Okay, so it is about one o'clock in the afternoon, and um, I just made it to Hitchcock. Um, Brady came yesterday, I believe, to set up his tent. Uh, it's kind of funny because we were worried about people camping and not having a tent spot, and there's plenty of tent spots. And the only tent around is our tent, so. So there it is, um, and I believe there's an aid station back that way, um, but it should be a good spot to see Brady during his race, so we'll definitely keep an eye out for him there. Um, he's going to end up here at 4, the race starts, or 5, the race starts at 9 tonight, so I'm going to try to get some uh, rest before he gets here. Okay, so uh, Brady just got here, and I just got done napping. So we're going to go see what's up. What up?
I got one cracked open. Um, I don't know. You want us to try to dry these socks out? Because if we hang them on here, for a little bit, I've got enough pairs. I should dry them. <coughs> How are your legs? I'm a little tired. Just tired? Yeah. I'm fine. Did you run with anybody for a while? or? No. I <laughs> was off the entire <laughs> Yeah. Keep chugging. Hey, your friend Casey was 146. <laughs> what? <Yeah>. 146. <laughs> Time. This is like six days post Hitchcock. I have not ran once. I've been pretty sick. Okay, so this is something that I didn't necessarily want to do, but I felt like I had to. Um, purpose for this is, I guess, a follow up to the Hitchcock experience and why I didn't finish. I mean, I don't necessarily have a hundred percent set in stone reason. It happens to everybody. I mean. I think it was a combination of me trying to switch my schedule, it not working, and me getting a lack of sleep, me being kind of sick. I woke up the day after from the day after the Hitchcock, the sickest I've ever been. And it was like I was sick for probably two days. I'm still getting over it. Um, not that that's an excuse because Jody won the hundred. 
with pneumonia and bronchitis. Bronchitis. Um, I just wasn't ready for it. I mean, it was super upsetting, obviously, to not finish. But there's nothing I could have done about it. It was better to not finish and me not hurt myself. Uh... That being said, I've got new plans and new goals coming, and I'm sure you'll all hear about them soon enough. Thank you for watching. Uh